Students at a growing number of U.S. universities are gathering in protest encampments with a unified demand that their schools cut financial ties to Israel. Demonstrations have been held at New York University, Harvard, MIT, and other universities in Michigan, Minnesota, and Columbia over the past 24 hours. They are calling for universities to separate themselves from any companies that are advancing Israel's savage military campaign in the besieged Gaza Strip. The students denounced companies profiting from the war on Gaza and demanded amnesty for students and faculty members who have been suspended for protesting. The protests against the genocide in Gaza began last week at Columbia University. Similar protests were held across the country, with students being at the front. Protesters on Wednesday also gathered near the residence of the Senate Majority Leader Chuck Schumer to call for the end of Washington's funding for Israel. Protesters stayed there for several hours despite a crackdown by the police. The demonstration was organized by the Jewish Voice for Peace and was attended by several rabbis. The recent protests in the states are inspired by the boycott, divestment and sanctions movement, a decades-old campaign against Israel's policies towards the Palestinians. Anti-riot troopers were called in to crack down on pro-Palestinian protesters at the University of Texas as similar rallies heated up across various universities in the United States. Eyewitness footage from Wednesday captured the troopers charging at the students, forcing them to the ground and detaining them while other protesters chanted, let them go. According to the Texas Tribune, at least 10 people were detained. Pro-Palestinian academic activism has significantly grown across the U.S. since the onset of the Israeli regime's U.S.-backed war of genocide against the Gaza Strip. The United States has provided maximal military and intelligence support to the regime since October 7th, when the latter unleashed the war. Moreover, Washington has vetoed several United Nations Security Council resolutions that called for a ceasefire in the brutal military onslaught, which has so far killed more than 34,100 Palestinians, most of them women and children. American students have been expressing outrage over their university's connections to the Israeli regime and Washington's unwavering support for the genocide. According to Reuters, tent protests are currently underway on campuses from coast to coast, including Brown University in Providence, Rhode Island, the University of Michigan in Ann Arbor, Massachusetts Institute of Technology in Cambridge, and California State Polytechnic in Humboldt. Across the U.S., Academics have been uniting under the banner of Faculty and Staff for Justice in Palestine FSJP, to support the war-stricken Palestinians. Most recently, the FSJP's Georgia chapter has called on Morehouse College in Atlanta, which has invited Joe Biden as its 2024 commencement speaker to rescind its invitation. This act is intended as a means of protesting the president's role in enabling the Israeli genocide, as reported by Press TV's website.